Hey there, Cassia. Working on another masterpiece? Uh, L Lucas, you know we're not supposed to. I Shh, mean... don't worry. I couldn't wait till after class. I just wanted a moment with you. Besides, we're alone right now. But, Lucas, what if we get caught? What if... Hey, look at me. Have we ever been caught before? You know I'd never let anything bad happen to you. One kiss, Cassia. That's all I ask. One kiss to make this gray school day a bit more colorful. Lucas, I... But, Lucas, someone might... Cassia, trust me. There's no one here but us. It's just a kiss. Come on, Cassia. Don't you feel it too? This moment is ours. Let's not waste it. Okay. Just... Just one kiss. Lucas! Cassia! What do you think you're doing? This is completely inappropriate! To the principal's office, now! Mrs. Jones, I'm so sorry! It wasn't what it looked like, we just... Enough, Cassia! I'm truly disappointed. I expected better judgment from you. Mrs. Jones, it's not Cassia's fault. I was the one who... Save it for the principal, Lucas. I won't tolerate such behavior in my classroom. Both of you, to the principal's office, now! We'll sort this out there. Mr. Thompson, I caught these two in an inappropriate situation in the art room. It's not the first time I've heard concerns about their conduct. I've observed a pattern of behavior from these two that's deeply concerning. Their disregard for school rules and the impact of their actions on the learning environment is unacceptable. Ms. Jones, could you elaborate on these concerns? Absolutely, Mr. Thompson. There have been multiple instances of them isolating themselves during school hours, and today, their behavior crossed the line. It disrupts not only their education, but also sets a poor example for other students. Cassia, I'm shocked. Your behavior is completely out of line with the standards of our school. Mr. Thompson, I just lost track of... Of everything. I never meant to cause any trouble. I'm truly sorry. I know I got everyone down, and it's... it's just so hard to bear. I understand it's difficult, Cassia, but rules are in place for a reason. We expect better from our students. And Lucas, this sort of recklessness is unacceptable. Your actions have consequences. Mr. Thompson, it was just a mistake. A moment of poor judgment. We didn't mean any harm. Enough, Lucas. This is a serious matter. Both of you compromised the school's code of conduct. Given the circumstances, I have no other option. Miss Jones, please prepare the suspension papers for both Cassia and Lucas. Please, Mr. Thompson, wait! I beg you, don't suspend me! This... This was a mistake. I promise it'll never happen again. Please, give me one more chance. Cassia, I understand this is hard, but actions have consequences. I must think about the school's rules and reputation. I know, and I'm sorry. I've never been in trouble before. Please, this will ruin everything for me. My future! I'll inform my father. He'll handle this. <sighs> I have no choice to involve your parents in this matter. You're both suspended until further notice. I've ruined everything. This is all a mess. My parents are going to be so disappointed. They've always trusted me. Hey, Cassia, don't worry. My dad will take care of it. He always does. That's easy for you to say. You're rich. You have no problems. But what about me? My parents aren't like yours. They value integrity. So what? I'm charming and your parents like me. They'll understand. No, Lucas, you don't get it! I'm not just talking about being charming. You pushed me into this and now I might lose everything. What? So this is my fault now. You kissed me back, Cassia. You wanted it too. I did, but I didn't want it to lead to this. I trusted you, Lucas. I thought you cared for me. Well, maybe that was your mistake. I can't deal with this right now. Cassia, that's all I ask. One kiss to make this gray school day a bit more colorful. Okay. 
Just... just one kiss. Lucas! Cassia! What do you think you're doing? You're both suspended until further notice. Well, maybe that was your mistake. I can't deal with this right now. <laughs> hey, Cassia! Come on down for dinner! Mom's made you your favorite... Huh? Cassia? Are you crying? What's wrong? What? No, it's nothing. Let's go eat. Cassia, you can't hide it from me. If you love me, you'll tell me what's going on. For my sake. It's... It's about school today. Lucas and I... We were caught in the art room. We were kissing and Mrs. Jones saw us. Oh, Cassia. It was so stupid. We were sent to Mr. Thompson's office. He was so disappointed in us. He said... He said we have to bring our parents to apologize for what happened in the classroom. Otherwise, we'll be suspended. He wants you to tell Mom and Dad? Cassia, that's serious. How are you going to? I can't, Calista. I just can't face them with this. They trust me and I've let them down. I've never seen them so disappointed. Hey, it's going to be okay. I'm here for you. We'll figure this out together. But what if they can't forgive me? What if they're too embarrassed by what I've done? Cassia, what you did wasn't right, and there should be consequences. But I understand why you're scared. Do you think they'll forgive me? I know, I know. And while they might be upset, they love you more than anything. We all make mistakes, Cassia. Are you sure, Callista? I don't want to drag you into this mess. They will. But we need to be honest with them. And I'll be there with you every step. We'll talk to the principal together. Wait, actually, let's keep this between us for now. I'll come with you to meet the principal and I'll talk to him. We can handle this without getting mom and dad involved. Thank you, Callista. I don't know what I'd do without you. Absolutely. You're my sister. And we'll face this together. Why is Castia here? I expected to see your parents, Cassia. This is a serious matter. Mr. Thompson, please hear us out. Our parents don't know, and Cassia is terrified of disappointing them. She knows she made a mistake, and she's ready to face the consequences. Mr. Thompson, I'm really sorry. I promise it won't happen again. Please, give me another chance. This is highly irregular. The school's reputation and rules are at stake here. I understand, sir. But Cassia is a good student. She's never been into trouble before. Everyone deserves a chance to learn from their mistakes. I'll do anything to make it right, Mr. Thompson. I'll take extra assignments, volunteer for school events, anything. What's the guarantee that this won't happen again? Why should I believe that Cassia has learned her lesson? Mr. Thompson, I know my sister. She's genuinely remorseful. And she's never been in trouble before. This... This was out of character for her. Yes, Mr. Thompson, I know. I've learned from my mistake. I'll prove it through my actions. I'll work harder to stay focused on my studies. All right. I'm willing to give you a last warning, Cassia. But this is it. One more slip up, and there will be severe consequences. Thank you, Mr. Thompson. I won't let you down. Thank you, sir. We appreciate your understanding. Remember, Cassia, last chance. I expect to see a change in your conduct. Now that this is settled, you need to be more careful, Cassia. What happened today can never happen again. Promise me. I promise, Callista. I've learned my lesson. No more trouble. And try to maintain some distance from Lucas. I know he means a lot to you, but right now... It's important to focus on yourself. I understand. I'll... I'll try. Just think about your future, okay? I care about you too much to see you get hurt. Lucas? Can we talk for a minute? Talk here, Cassia. What's so important? Lucas, please, can we just talk alone? Just for two minutes? Why? Afraid to speak in front of everyone? Come on, Cassia. We're all friends here. Say it now. My sister. 
She apologized to Mr. Thompson for us. Apologized? For what? Just spit it out, Cassia. For... for that kiss in the art room? <laughs> oh, an apology for a little kiss? How dramatic! My dad called the principal. I'm fine, see? Not a loser like you. Look at me, then look at you. Nerd. What's wrong with you, Lucas? Why are you acting like this? I'm sorry, Cassia. I didn't mean to. You know how much I love you. I can't lose you, Lucas. I know. I'm sorry. I shouldn't have been rude to you. It's okay. Just please don't be so harsh with me. Hey, I want to tell you something. What? I've organized a pool party at my mansion tonight. You're coming because you're my girlfriend, right? Lucas, you know I don't like parties. And, and a pool party? I, I don't even own a swimsuit. Come on, Cassia. It'll be fun. I'll even give you a swimsuit. You need to loosen up. But Lucas, parties just aren't my thing. And a pool party? I don't know. Hey, it's just us and a few friends. Nothing crazy. You'll be with me. Trust me, it'll be great. I... I... I, I can't. What's the big deal, Cassia? Why do you always have to be so uptight? Just this once, can't you... Can't you just have a little fun? I'm not uptight, Lucas. I just... I'm not comfortable with this kind of thing. You know what? You're not my type anymore. You're not fun at all. You're just a boring nerd. Lucas, why are you being so mean? I just... Look, Cassia, I didn't mean to. Just forget it. Wait, Lucas! I'll come. Yes, I'll be there. Really? You'll come? Yes, I'll come. That's more like it. See? I knew you could be fun. Great. 10 p.m. Don't forget, okay? Hey, look! The nerd decided to grace us with her presence! This isn't your place, bookworm! Or maybe she wants to join. Come on, take off your clothes and show us your moves! <laughs> she will, she will. Come here, Cassia. She's my girlfriend, and she's here to join us at this pool party! Lucas, what are you saying? Yes, and you're gonna join me. Come on. Where are we going? Just come, babe. this I don't feel comfortable in it come on it's a pool party you've got to wear it okay I'll do it great change into it now what what why are you still standing here I need to change all right but I could stand here and watch just for fun but okay I'll wait outside I know, right? No wonder Lucas left her for that dumb nerd. Hey Lucas, how you been? Missing me yet? Hey, Ravenna. I'm good, thanks. But you know I'm with Cassia now. Oh, I know, but we had some fun times, didn't we? Remember our last summer party? <laughs> sure, it was fun. Times change, Ravenna. They say change is good, but some things are too good to change, don't you think? Maybe, but I'm all for new experiences. Like, you know, respecting my girlfriend. So, Lucas, tell me, what does that little nerd have that I don't? Didn't I give you everything you wanted? It's not about what you did or didn't give, Ravenna. It's about respect. Cassio respects me. That's all I want. 
Really? Just respect. I thought you liked fun, Lucas. Remember all the good times we had? Ravenna, that's in the past. I'm with Cassia now. Let's just enjoy the party, okay? <laughs> all right, Lucas. Have it your way. Enjoy your party. That's Ravenna for you. Always keeping the door open. <laughs> You're always so serious, Lucas. Remember to have a little fun sometimes. Bye, Lucas. Enjoy your party. Lucas, why did Ravina kiss you? Oh, that? Ravina's just being her usual self. Don't mind her. She's a jerk. By the way, you look incredibly hot in that swimsuit. I don't know, Lucas. I'm not sure about this. Just give it a try, Cassia. Let's have some fun together. It's okay. I just thought we could have some alone time, you know. Alone time? Lucas, I'm not sure about this. Come on, Cassia. We're adults, and it's just us here. Everyone's doing it. Why wait? No, Lucas, I'm not ready for this. I can't just do it because everyone's doing it. But Cassia, it's normal. I care about you. And I thought you cared about me, too. I do care about you, Lucas. But that doesn't mean I have to prove it like this. I'm not ready for that step. What's your problem, Cassia? Why are you being so difficult? Get away! <gasps> oh, I'm so sorry, Lucas. I didn't mean to. Sorry? You're just like everyone says. A nerd. No fun at all. But Benno was right about you. She's so much better. She knew how to have fun. Not like you. Is that why you're with me? Just for fun? I thought you cared about me. Cared? I thought you were different. But you're just a boring little girl. I need someone exciting. Someone like Ravenna. Lucas, how can you say that? I thought we had something special. Special? Please. I need someone who can keep up with me, not hold me back. I can't believe this is who you really are. Believe it. It's over. Now I'll get what I want. Lucas, no! Someone help me, please! No, Shh. Lucas! No, I beg you! Here. Cassia? Why aren't you ready for school? You're usually the first one up. Oh, I'm just feeling a bit under the weather today, Callista. Cassia, you've never missed school for a little cold. What's really going on? You can tell me. Whatever it is, Cassia, I'm here for you. We'll face it together. We need to speak with Cassia immediately. Is she here? Yes, she's inside. What is this about? Is there a problem, officers? It's a matter of urgency. We need to speak to her immediately. I'm Cassia. What's happening? Cassia, you are under arrest for the murder of Mr. Lucas. <gasps> What? Murder? No, that can't be true! My Cassia wouldn't- There's gotta be a mistake. Cassia, tell them. I don't understand. I didn't do anything. She's innocent. This is all wrong. We need to take her in for questioning. Please, cooperate. Please, she's just a child. Can we talk about this? Wait, there has to be another explanation. Mom, Dad, 
I didn't do it! I didn't hurt Lucas! <laughs> we know, sweetheart. We believe you. Don't worry, Cassia. We'll find a way to prove your innocence. Cassia, look at me. You're my perfect sister. And I know you're innocent. I'll do everything to bring you justice. But why? Why is this happening to me? We need to speak with the parents for a moment. Please, this way. Listen, Cassia, you're strong, and we'll get through this together. Remember how we always stick together, no matter what? Calista, I'm scared. What if they don't believe me? They will, because I won't rest until they see the truth. You are my perfect sister, Cassia. Nothing will change that. But Calista, I'm so scared. Everything's just falling apart. I didn't do anything wrong. I know, Cassia. And that's exactly why we won't give up. I won't let this break you. You're not just my sister. You're my best friend. My role model. I just feel so lost, Callista. How did everything get so messed up? Life throws the worst at us sometimes. But it's how we come out of it that matters. You've taught me that. Now, let me be your strength. You've always been my rock, Callista. And I will always be. We'll walk out here together with our heads held high. I promise you, Cassia. I'll do whatever it takes to clear your name. Tell me everything that happened at the party. How were Cassia and Lucas? They seemed pretty happy, at least when they were in the pool. But Cassia looked a bit uncomfortable at first. Yeah, Lucas kind of pushed her to join in, but after a while, she seemed to relax. So, everyone seemed happy at the pool party? Did you notice anything unusual about Cassia or Lucas? Well, Cassia did seem a bit uncomfortable. Lucas kind of forced her to join in the pool. Yeah, she wasn't really into it at first, but they looked okay after a while. Is there anything else you remember? Anything that might help at all? Oh! Lucas' ex, Ravenna, was there. She kissed him, and Cassia saw it. That's probably why Cassia did it. She must have been jealous or something. I... I don't think it's because of Ravenna. She and Lucas, they've been over for a while. You sound unsure. Is there something that you're not telling us? No, no, it's just, I don't think Cassia would do that. She's not like that. Hmm. Thank you, everyone. Your insights have been very helpful. Hey, sweetie, you look worried. What's wrong? Ravenna, I can't do this anymore. This is getting too risky. But you've been such a good help. Remember the night I showed you how grateful I could be? That's not enough. I saw what you did to Lucas. I saw you stabbed him. You know, Lucas never listened to me either. He always had to overshadow me, and look where that got him. Please! I don't want any part of this! You have two choices, darling. Face the same fate as Lucas, or keep enjoying my... appreciation. What's it going to be? Ravenna, you're under arrest for the murder of Lucas. And DC, you are also under arrest for aiding and abetting. Ridiculous! Why am I being arrested? We have everything we need, Ravenna. Your confession is recorded on my phone. It's over. You think a little recording will hold up? You've made a huge mistake! No, Ravina. The only mistake was underestimating my sister. You'll pay for this! Both of you! Callista! I owe you my life! You never gave up on me! 
You don't need to thank me, Cassia. I always knew you were my perfect sister. I'd do anything for you.